And boom, we're in for episode 10 of the... Someone's playing music in the background of the Solo Q series. And let me just tell this guy I can hear him. Uh, yeah, I can hear you. And I think this could be a pinnacle episode. A pinnacle episode? Pivotal episode, not pinnacle episode. Although we might reach a pinnacle. The pivotal episode. Because I think with where we are ELO-wise... If we win this game, we'll get into into diamond. I think we're right on the edge of whether we're going to be able to or not. Um, that just banned, um, and someone's playing ace, so that sort of frees me up a little bit to do something else. Should we get on the entry? Should we get on the ash? I haven't really played much entry in this series. I just put on thirty four and bald, not very good at it, but we'll do it. If no one's playing the ash, I've got to. So what have we got here? I oh, know so he's playing the ace. Okay, now if I... Who's, we've bomb. banned... Okay. I'll play the ash and show you how to get the stuff off the wall quite quickly. Depending on... If it's a Cade, I might struggle a bit more. Let's see if I can get this over in the corner to see if we put any denial on the wall. Uh, it's smokes reinforcing the wall, which is usually... Which is a good sign. Because normally Bandit or Cade would reinforce the wall. Now, I actually don't want this drone in here. Um, because I need to use it for me getting into the map. But so far, Goyo and Smoke, which is a good sign. If you could stop red pinging, that'd be really good. Um, so we've got no... Uh, oh, hang on. Warden and Jaeger. So I don't think that last one's going to be a bandit. We might have free reign to let Ace just worry about the wall himself here. Uh, right, there's a default cam. Just been shot. I'm just going to watch the... Run out onto garage. Although doing this with an R4C is not the best decision I've ever made. Just about got away with that. If anyone is watching that going, I wonder if he can control the R4C. The answer is only just. I feel this one might come again, you know. Why? I just, that was so weird. I just felt that that was going to happen then. I really should have killed that Goyo there. That's poor from me. Does he, he doesn't come again, does he, surely? I really wish I'd have got that kill there. That's Goyo there. I assume. Yeah, that's Goyo. Okay, sweet. So he got the cam. Okay, let's try and cause some mischief. Oh, nading. Ah, top of the stairs. He's just saved my life. I'm going to rush to barbecue side quickly. I oh, know we need the diffuser. We need the diffuser. One all the way down the corridor there. The has been recovered. He's currently in showers. Tight right, I want a tight right. Now the worry for me here is I am super low HP. If there's a goo mine here, I'm done. There isn't. Come on. Get me on the entry. What am I doing? I should always be playing Ash. I had to concentrate a little bit then, so I went a bit quiet. I'm sorry about that. Right. I, I wish I'd have killed that Goyo. That was so weird, though. How the warden ran out, and then I thought... I just knew. I thought, you know what? Someone else is jumping out here. Um, I don't know why I thought that, but... Hey, look. I'm going to put it down to unbelievable game sense. No, I'm just kidding. Uh, right, so... Let's see what operators the team pick again, and then we'll base our choice on what gaps need to be filled... Um, Blackbeard's an interesting choice. Um, so, I've not seen any hard breach there, which is a worry. So we've gone from one end of the scale to the other. We've gone from playing Ash to playing Thermite. It doesn't get more opposite in terms of roles, does it? By the way, the R4C feels so good again. Like It still has way more recoil than it used to. But it's a lot less than it did have. Does that make sense? You know, it, like the recoil started here, 
Then it went way up here, and then now it's sort of come back down to about halfway between. Um, but it's such a fun gun to use. Ooh. Right, so they've got a bandy this time. So, we need ash. So, when I was telling you how to get the stuff off the wall, all you got to do is come to this window and pretty much shoot an ash charge directly up because the floor there is soft. Uh, ash, could you go and ash charge underneath the wall, please, from the window that's on 5 ping? Ten seconds to go. Oh, you're not playing uh, ash anymore. Okay. I can, I can. Okay, thank you. Just to get the bandit batteries off. This is. You must locate oh, okay. We sound like we've got a good team here. Love that. Now, who's going to watch the garage run out, though? That's the question, isn't it? Do I go and watch the garage run out quickly? Ping that window again from him. Surely. No one runs out again, right? But I feel they may punch. Guys, I am absolutely on fire in terms of the predictions. I thought they were going to make a punch hole here. Is Ash? Wait, Ash is dead. And on your left. the wall's still electrified. Okay. Don't advise standing in the middle of a window when you're using your drone, by the way. You located a bomb. Okay, let's go on. There's two of them up, right? Oh, there was a mozzie pest there. Is that mozzie pest still there? Ah, I nearly got sh- Oh, and it's still up. He's probably going to be watching that jump in now. Okay, well that's that plan up the wayside. I've got diffuser, so I've got to think about what to do a little bit here. So the rest of the team have gone that side, so I should probably do the same thing and make sure that we team up. There's no point in me pushing from that side on my own when I've got no info. I'm playing on my own. Aon is in barbecue. I can probably get a drone around there quickly. Although I don't know if I'm going to have time. I honor I'll drone for you, hang on. I'm just bringing a drone around now. Shit. One's in the hallway. Okay. One's tight right of the door and one's in the hallway. Close to the five ping. Four last operators standing. What? And you heard that he ran away, which was see how he ran all the way back to dorms, which was sensible because he knew that I had to plant. So that he played, Bandit played that perfectly there. Um, if I'd have had three more seconds, I wouldn't have had to sprint there. That was a tough situation. Um, Bandit there has played that absolutely perfectly. So he's waited until there's like, what, five seconds, eight seconds, whatever it was left, and then just ran away because he knows I either have to push him or plant. And if I'm going to start planting, he can just push me again. So, yeah. It's, couldn't really done a lot there. Just wanted to. If you're with a team there, we absolutely win that because we know where the last two are and we can coordinate pushing. Um, but obviously we're not with a team. So who are we here? We don't be gridlock. Mm, it could be gridlock. We could have Ace get the stuff off the wall, or we could play <clears throat> Ash or Zof. Let's play Zof. I haven't played Zof for a while. Let's do some Zof. Um, yeah, let's do some Zof. And we will go and try and get the denial off the wall that hopefully Ace is going to try and open, all being well. This microphone arm is driving me mad. Um, it keeps just, like, sagging, drooping, flopping, going flaccid, and every other word you can think of. Um, let's try and get a drone up here. And then on... Oh, too far, Tony. Ten seconds to go. 
shelf would be nice. Oh, shoot the radio. What? I've never noticed that radio up there before. That needs to be gotten rid of. Oh, someone's running out of somewhere. Here, I think. No, yeah. Changing mags. Should we bait him out with a drone? drone ready. Not drone, yeah. Okay, so that's paid up there. Massive kill from that guy. Okay, so we've got mute playing top of garage. Loading new magazine. Can I go and help? Ace is nowhere near the wall, so there's no point in me even trying to open that. Massive. Not massive. Oh, see, this is what happens when you get into a, an advantage. Mute's not dead, so Mute must be up here somewhere. Here's his bug me, I can hear it. Oh, Mute's now dead. Gonna have a quick drone again. I'm not in a rush. If I get pushed here, then I take it all back. I'm just drone. I'm just droning Flores. Hang on. Come on. I tell you what, that's. I'm really pleased with myself there. I'm really pleased with myself there to uh, to pre-fire where I thought he was gonna run across past that doorway. I'm really. I I don't really chuff myself out. See, I would rather get a kill like that than, like, four one-taps. I mean, one-taps are cool, don't be wrong. But there's something about when you get a kill where you use your brain. That's why I love Siege, man. You use your brain and you're like, oh, uh, yeah, okay, yeah, that was good. That was cool. Right. We are going piano laundry, which I despise. I'm going to make a point of that by saying I actually want to defend there instead because I don't like piano laundry. And we are going to play... No, we're going to have to play on site, aren't we? Looking at the operators we've got there, Mozzie's not going to be on site. Warden's not going to be on site. Doc probably is going to be on site, but might not be. Um, so looking at what we've picked there, we've definitely got to pick an operator that can play on site. Uh, no, I don't want to do it. I want to reinforce this, sorry. Let's get some mute jammers on the drone hole. Did you know you can put a mute jammer here, which blocks the drone hole, and you can then also open the hatch. I watch it not work now, but it's worked before. Yeah, look, that mute jammer's over there, but you can also then open the hatch. That's cool, eh? It feels like the mute jammer should fall off, but it doesn't. All right, Mozzie, the pest there. Took this in just here. That's a really nice spot for a mute jammer there. Completely denies any uh, drone getting up there. Let's see, I'll rotate here. Need a rotate already. Oh, see, that's not a good rotator. This. This is where you want your rotate here, so you can come in without worrying about the bomb. Yes, you have to worry about games, but you're always going to have to worry about games. Um, let's just open that hatch. Yeah, quick jammer on here. Ready. Hello? What's that made of? Little mute jammer slots in there, lovely as well. Oh, right, spot on. Oh, what the hell was that? This is getting pretty spicy pretty quickly. Did you see the frame rate of that C4 going through there then? It's 60 FPS. Sorry, by the way, that's a lovely throw as well. People don't always make this rotate, by the way, but it's really, really handy. You can get your feet shot off through this gap by the drone hole that's over there, so just be careful about that. Oh, we've got a dock there. Op four, last op standing. Hello? Is he on the breach? Where he is. Okay, not sure where he is. 
3v1 is ultimate troll territory, by the way. It's where everyone... F Why can't I hear a C4? It's where everyone feels the most confident. But it's where it's the easiest to cock up. Huge! From Twig Lover. Well played, boys. This is it, you know. This round... This round might be the round. By the way, let me tell you. I'm sorry that the solo queue video is a day late. I'm going to try and be positive about this. But yesterday, uh, as in Monday, I tried recording this. Well, actually, it is now still Monday, but it's 11 o'clock at night Monday. I tried recording this at the normal time that I do the solo queue video. It's now obviously 11 o'clock, so it's way too late to upload it. But I tried to... Hang oh, on, bear with me. Party off, he's going to mute again. Uh, oh, mirror, 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 mirror. Let's do some mirror. I tried to upload it. Um, uh, tried to make the video, sorry, yesterday. Between the hours of 6 and about... Sometimes it was 6 and about half 8. And I played 5 games and 4 of them contained a cheater. And I don't want to moan about it because everyone knows it's bad at the moment. And I just don't want to... I don't want to keep talking about how bad it is. Because it's, it's a negative thought. And I'm trying to not have negative thoughts, essentially. And I don't want to... Everyone knows cheating's bad. It doesn't need me to come on here and go, oh, the cheating's shocking. Sort it out. Everyone knows it's bad, so we don't need to worry about that. Um, what? What I am going to do, though, is just say, look, it's been, it's been bad this season. We all know it's been bad. It's been the worst that I've ever experienced, for sure, um, since I've started playing Siege. Like, normally, I used to get play a couple of cheaters a week, and yeah, it's not ideal, but I could get over it, and, it, you know, I could deal with it. Um, this season's been has been poor. So, um, so it's, the video's late because all of it, the games that I was in yesterday um, were cheater games. You know, there was a game that I played yesterday that had four cheaters in. Two on my team and two on their team. And obviously, the, ch the cheater on my team must have had better... Uh, please don't reinforce that. The cheater on my team must have had better cheats because we won the game. Um, so I'm going to lose that elo as well, but... No, it is what it says. Anyone opening this wall? Yeah, they are. <sighs> That's an issue. Gotta watch behind me now. Although I could hope Jaeger plays there, and then I could just play off Jaeger. Um, what did you have for your dinner? That's the big question. What have you had for your dinner? Tonight, I had sausages, mashed potato, and beans. Baked beans. English baked beans. Well, and I tell you what. I know baked beans are a weird concept to some people, but if you haven't had baked beans, you want to get involved. This setup, by the way, is really good. If you've got a team like the playing the um, Breach, like Jaeger is here, it's really solid because you can watch Garage and watch uh, games. Um, I could probably go and... There's at least two attackers out there because I can hear two different types of guns. And one's above me on the roof. So I imagine this window is about to be opened. That's the Jaeger dead, which is a problem. Oh no, Alibi's come to play the breach now, which is good. I feel like I just did a zero camera somewhere. Okay, they're flashing. I know, I'm, I'm sure there's still one on the roof. Op 4, last operator station. I need to crossfire with Moz here. One friendly remaining. Just about made it round that corner. So that that there is a bit of in fact, you know what, I'm gonna say it again, right? A bit of good game sense from me there. I knew that, that Jaeger was holding that side of the breach, so I knew I had to go to the other side of the breach to make it impossible for Thermite to get through that door. I was a little bit late in doing it, but we managed to just get there. What have we got? Six and one there. It's a good game. We're on Outback. We're commending everyone because... Were they friendly and fair? Yes. Let's have a look. Drum roll, please. Maybe I should edit a drum roll into this bit now. Team, we're there. We've done it. We've done it! We solo queued to Diamond on the Tony Pulis account in year eight season three heavy metal i think it's called if i remember rightly what a journey and you know what it's mad we've done it on the 10th episode 
Now, I know we've hit Diamond, but we've got how long have we got until the new season comes out? In fact, let's go back to the Battle Pass um, on the main menu, and we'll just have a quick look. You can usually have a good idea when the Battle Pass ends. Um, I know it's flickering. Don't worry about that. Um, ends in 20 days. Okay, so there's about three weeks left of the season, uh, which means, yeah, the new season's going to come out in about three weeks' time, give or take. So we might as well carry on doing it for the next three weeks, and we might as well carry on doing it then for every week thereafter, really. I really enjoy doing the solo queue series with... it's. I've said to you before, it's a bit of a strange one, because I talk to you on YouTube, but I have to just talk, like, sort of think out loud. So it's a bit strange, but I've enjoyed doing it. And we've hit we've hit Diamond on, on the solo queue account. We hit Diamond on the main account as well. I don't up really upload gameplay from the main account. That's probably something I should do as well. Um, I'll get around to that at some point. But we've made it, and we'll carry on. We'll, we'll, we'll do another couple of episodes of this and probably just even push into, like, Diamond 3 maybe. Um, I've never, ever hit Champ in all the seasons that I've played Siege, so I should probably make a push for Champ at some point just to say I've done it on the main account, obviously, not on this one. Um, but cheers for joining for the ride. Um, I will... Yeah, try try and hit champ at some point, perhaps. Um, but anyway, apologies, by the way. There's been a few less videos uploaded over the last couple of weeks. It's been manic at my end. Um, I don't do this full-time. I do this in my spare time. I've also got two kids, and I work, like, 50 hours a week in a fairly stressful job. So... Um, yeah, apologies for the video being a little bit a little bit less, but fingers crossed we can get back on schedule um, sort of middle of this week onwards. And also, sorry for this video being a day late as well. Anyway, Neville's not here because it's 11 o'clock at night. I should probably go and get my head down and get some rest at some point. But we've made it. We've done it. Tony Pulis' solo account is Diamond, and I'm really grateful that you joined me for the ride. So thank you very much for watching it. I've said it all the time at the end of every video, and today is no different. If you've watched it 10 times, if you've watched it for 10 minutes, or if you've watched it for 10 hours, thank you. All for 10 seconds, I'm really, really grateful. I appreciate everybody getting involved. We recently hit 30k, which is wild for me. And thank you to everyone who's been kind enough to say congrats on the on the previous video we did, the Echo video, I think it was. Um, so yeah, thanks for getting involved as always. I really appreciate every one of you. Um, other than that, I'll see you next time. Cheers!